We are still here at the running event in Austin, Texas uh, with Keith from Sketches. Keith, thank you so much for taking the time to talk us through this like monster of a shoe. How to call it? It, it looks super special. Yeah, this is our new Speed Beast. Uh, the positioning of this shoe, it's technically going to be part of that super shoe category, but the objection of this shoe is really going to go after not that tip of the spear marathoner, but more of that AB corral, that 250 to 330, 345 marathoner. As you get past that 18 mile mark, your form starts to break down. And so what we're going to start with is a much wider footprint on the outsole. You, as your, your strike point starts to fall further back, you're going to have a little bit more heel stability, a lot more midfoot stability. We're going to bring that rubber up into the midfoot. So as you're coming down to that midfoot, you're going to have more stability there. You'll also notice that we've got quite a bit of rubber. In previous uh, versions of the Super Shoe, we've stripped out as much as we could to make it as light as possible. With this, we want to give some durability. A lot of the other Super Shoes out there, people are getting 150 miles, 200 miles. If you're going to spend that much on a product, we want to make sure you can have the versatility. You can do up-tempo workouts, interval workouts, uh, you know, and you're just going to have a lot of versatility in this. You don't have to just put it in the corner and wait for a race day. This is going to have our new Hyperburst Pro midsole. So that is a super critical TPU. It's pure 100% TPU pellets that we put through the super critical foaming process. You will have that carbon infused H plate. This one is the rigid one. So this one is going to be a little bit more flexible again for that AB corral runner, it, but it will accentuate that rolling motion from midfoot to toe off. It's gonna have a very fast toe off, getting you into your next uh, swing stage. Uh, as we move to the upper, we're gonna have a hyper mono mesh upper very lightweight, it's gonna be unstructured, will create a little structure with the welding and the foam package, but a speed tongue, just enough to keep the lace pressure down. So overall, just a great racing shoe for that, that three hour, 3.30 type marathoner. So what's the stack height and the offset on this one? Uh, so this is gonna be World Athletic approved, so we're gonna sit right at 40. Uh, with all of our speed product, we'll have a four millimeter offset, so you'll have 36 in the forefoot, 40 in the heel. Uh, on the inside of the shoe, we're also gonna have that super critical uh, TPU footbed. Uh, it's going to have that arch fit. It will be a thinner version, so we're going to save some weight and reduce the thickness. But again, as you're kind of crashing down in that pronation, you're going to have a more supportive shoe there for you. What's the, the release date and the price point on this one? Uh, the release date is going to be 3-1 of next year. And right now it's currently at $250. We're trying to get it closer to $200 by release date. Awesome. Wow. Good job, Sketches. Yeah. Thanks so much. Um, this is another shoe that I am excited about, and I guess you as well. Uh, check the Sketches playlist for more content. Ride 11, Max Route 6, and this Speed Beast here. Uh, thanks so much, Keith, for having us. Thank you. Thank you.